And I'm back. Okay, so here's the plan. I'm going to go back. I'm going to make a record player because that's part of my goals anyway. That's one diamond. Still is near 10. And I think I still have a couple others as well, which means I could likely make. Oh, wait, what's this? That's me looking at a cheaty hole. Actually, that's not what that is. But. Continue on. See, here's the thing. I could basically wander around the ocean looking for more abandoned mines and hopefully find chests. And in the chest, I'm hoping to get essentially a book. If I could get a book, then I would basically be there. That would be what I would need. Hmm. Let's come back here a sec. Something doesn't quite look right. Should go far. And then it's like a stealth bomber. Now I came here because I wanted to just take a quick look at all this. Oh, you know what? I've been messing up. I grabbed a pumpkin before I left. And a pumpkin with a torch gives me the jack o' lantern. So this down here is waterproof lighting. Look at that. doesn't help me one iota. But it's cool. And it can help me quite a bit. But for right now, I think the first thing I'm going to do is head back I've uncovered a fair bit of islands, I've found a couple ravines and things like that, obviously. Oh, am I back already? No, I am. I'm back home. That was faster than I thought. Good. Well, we don't call a home sweet home for nothing. How much daytime do I have? Half a day? Let's take stock. Such a humble place. Okay. I want those. No, I guess I didn't have any diamonds left over. That's the food chest. Well, one diamond. Makes a jukebox. Yay! Number five. Ta-da! Looked after. I'll place that in the special projects chest. For now made. 
Ta-da. All right. Ten. Boots are four. That's five. That's seven. Four would leave me a six. So I can do top and bottom. Ah, uh, I could make a diamond sword. Yeah, let's do that. Okay. A diamond sword to defend myself. gold. Crazy. Uh, bones for days. Right. Before I make the portal. Right now that I've got that, I guess I'll make a breastplate. Right? Gotta think of myself. So I've got some pretty good gear now for enchanting. Oh, hold on. Let's take that off. Let's take that off. Let's take that off. You three guys go there. Uh, boots, pants, hat. I gotta do it like that. Pants, boots, hat. Look at that. Fully decked out. All right. I can put that back. I'm going to put that in there. I'm going to need this for a moment. Before I build the portal, I have to go to the nether. Here. I'll speak correctly eventually. Before I go to the nether, I need to go collect more obsidian. Which is why I grabbed my diamond pickaxe. I think it was this way, right? certainly can be.
Yeah, this is where I was mining it out earlier. So let's uh, let's start here. What I'm doing is making enough that I can uh, just go ahead and make a portal in the nether. I'm not interested in hanging out too long, to be honest. I tend to have bad experiences in the nether. Just in case you're wondering, I may have said it before, but the purpose of putting the water is in case there happens to be lava underneath here, like if the lava was more than one deep. I've only turned obsidian on the top. So what this does is the water will turn any lava below into more obsidian and it won't burn the obsidian block that I just broke. So you can see there's two of them right there that I just broke up. Like that. Okay. Now I said I needed a minimum of 10 to make a portal, right? I've got 25. I'm going to go with that. It's the middle of the night, isn't it? this make a good portal room? What else am I doing with it? The thing about obsidian is you really don't want to fuck it up. Because there's no do-overs. So yeah, let's use uh, Mossy. There we go. One portal. so stupid doing this.
I've got torches. I don't have enough cobble. And I don't need to bring water. It's not yet daylight. Alright, I gotta pause, think about this.